y'all hey it's Trey Monet back to y'all with another video today's video is super 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 exciting as always you guys in today's video we are going to be discussing 2022 side hustles that you need to be implementing right now <laughs> uh, you guys these side hustles can make you anywhere between 500 a thousand two thousand maybe five thousand dollars a month you guys i've seen it with my own two eyes and i wanted to come here and share with you guys some additional side hustles i know a lot of you guys are interested in starting your own businesses and you're like troya where am i going to get these funds in order to do these things how can i turn my side hustle into an actual lucrative business i want to maybe leave, leave my nine to five in 2022. you want to stay tuned for this entire video so that way you can figure out some different side hustles that you can implement to turn your time into dollars okay period so let's go ahead and jump right on in but before we do don't forget to rate comment like subscribe all of that good stuff let's go ahead and get started all right you guys so let's go ahead and dive right on in so the first side hustle that i want to mention to you guys is going to be renting your space and this has been a side hustle that has been extremely lucrative for a lot of people in the year 2021 so maybe looking into doing airbnb peer space toro or you can even look into doing curb flip these are really great options for you to make some additional passive income. Airbnb is something I'm going to be looking to doing a lot more of um, in the year 2022. I've done a lot of research on the background of Airbnb, but actually implementing it in the year 2022. So I'm really excited about it. We know Airbnb is an extremely lucrative side business that you can get your feet wet into. So even if you don't want to, you know, rent out an extra apartment or sign an extra lease or purchase an extra home in order to do Airbnb, maybe plan out your year at far far in advance you know that you're going to be out of town maybe this weekend this weekend this weekend maybe go through and decide to put your home on airbnb during those weekends since you'll know that you'll be out of town anyway go ahead and make you that vacation money while you're on vacation okay so airbnb is going to be something extremely lucrative for you to look into also peer space so peer space and airbnb are quite similar but not really so peer space is a is a platform where you're able to rent out your property on an hourly basis instead of airbnb you're going to be renting that out on a daily basis so peer space is so 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 lucrative you guys i'm excited to do a little bit more research into it myself i actually used a peer space platform for my black friday cyber monday campaign i rented out a mansion over here in tampa i paid the seller or the renter 200 dollars an hour and after I rented it, I was just discussing her, discussing it with her so I can get some more information. And she said that her house, she rents it out probably several times out of the month. $200 an hour, you guys. So extremely lucrative based business there is Pure Space. You're renting that out on an hourly basis for maybe photo shoots, events, um, meeting spaces, things of that nature. Whereas Airbnb, of course, that's going to be somewhere that someone is going to sleep. Um, almost like hotel style so airbnb peer space you guys can also look into doing turo so if you have an extra car or if you want to lease an extra car to go through and put that on turo really great platform to make some additional money instead of folks having to use um, rental car services you can also look into using curb flip so curb flip is where you can rent out your parking spaces so if you live in a very busy crazy crazy neighborhood looking to doing curb flip and you can rent out your actual parking spaces on that platform up next you guys is going to be creating a service or maybe e-commerce business we're going to put this as two in number three so of course service-based businesses are on the rise i own a service-based business and i do also own an e-commerce business very great platforms to get your feet wet into i think it's so cool to see service-based um businesses turn into product-based businesses and product-based businesses turn into uh, service-based businesses i think that it's so dope to go through and see that transition service-based businesses can be just a little bit of anything you guys so if you're really good at graphic design maybe turn that into a, some type of service-based business where you're creating graphics and flyers and websites for different clients if you're really good at makeup, maybe look into turning that into maybe a side hustle where you can do makeup on the side. I know in college I did makeup on the side and it got me some really good extra money for food, clubbing, or anything like that while I was in college. You can even look into being a hairstylist, lash check, so many different services out there that people actually need and desire. E-commerce businesses are also on the rise, you guys. I own an e-commerce business, Wanted Wardrobe 
where I sell women's clothing. So e-commerce businesses are on the rise. I would definitely say that this is a side hustle that's going to take you a little bit more time to develop, a little bit more time to go through and grow. But e-commerce businesses are extremely lucrative as well, and they are on the rise in the year 2022. All right, you guys. So up next is going to be becoming a virtual assistant. This is something I've seen skyrocket in the year 2021. As more people start businesses, y'all know everybody's mama, brother, cousin, sister, auntie, everybody out here starting businesses, right? So as our businesses tend to grow, we need help. <laughs> we may not be in a position for us to, you know, hire a part-time or full-time employee, you know, into our business. So we might go through an outsource or freelancer who may consider themselves as a virtual assistant. I actually went through and hired my first virtual assistant and shout out to her because she has been doing an amazing job and making things a lot easier on my end as far as comms between me and my clients, me and my customers. And virtual assistants, y'all can make some money. I've seen it firsthand because my assistant, she a pretty penny, okay? So I've seen it firsthand. You can easily, being a virtual assistant, make anywhere between $500 to even $5,000 a month. Of course, that just depends on the virtual assistant's expertise, how much time they're spending doing things, all the different tasks that they're going to be doing. But virtual assistant Shaw can make some good, good, good money. So maybe look into doing that in the year 2022 as well as a side hustle. All right, you guys, and up next is going to be creating online courses. So if you're an expert in, in something, in some type of field or industry, or if you're very educated in some type of field or industry, why not turn that into an online course? So like I talked about earlier, if you're good at graphic design, teach other people how to become graphic designers. Offer that as a course within the service pl platform that you already offer. Me, for example, I'm a business coach. I don't offer any courses per se, but I am a coach and I do offer different coach-based businesses or coach-based services rather. So look into doing courses. If you're a hairstylist, teach other people how to become hairstylists or how to get their cosmetology license. That's a really cool course that you can implement as well. Or how to make um, wigs at home. Something similar to, those, to that as well, you guys. So online courses are on the rise. Everyone's interested in learning instead of actually attending college or attending some type of school or academy these days. So I think that courses are definitely going to be on the rise and definitely a business that you might want to get your hands wet into as well. All right, you guys, so up next is something I'm really excited about getting my feet wet into in the year 2022, and that is offering digital printable products via Etsy. If you have been sleeping under a rock, then you probably don't even know that Etsy is literally the hub of digital and printable templates, products, guides, ebooks, Canva templates, you name it, Etsy has it on their platform. And it is an extremely lucrative impact and it just creates a really great passive income when you are doing things of that nature, you guys. So I'm really excited to throw up some different templates on Etsy or some different, um, guides ebooks on etsy as well to in order to make some additional passive income there too all right you guys so up next is going to be cryptocurrency this is not the most sexiest topic it's actually something i'm educating myself a lot more into as well but cryptocurrency is on the rise you guys and we can definitely see that by the increase in popularity of nfts so if you have not been you know on social media then it, you wouldn't know that nfts are digital forms of art so it's basically just digital artwork and nfts are on the rise you guys so maybe looking into doing nfts maybe something as far as stocks maybe something as far as forex trading or anything along those lines so cryptocurrency is also a really great passive income and a really great side hustle that you might want to look into getting into in the year 2022 as well all right, you guys, up next is going to be starting a YouTube channel. Just like you're watching here on my YouTube channel, starting a YouTube channel is at not only really, really fun, but extremely lucrative as well. And this also kind of piggybacks off of my next topic as well, is becoming an influencer. We all know YouTube is so lucrative. You're able to make money off of being monetized here on YouTube, and that also transpires into you maybe even becoming an uh, influencer. So companies these days, you guys, are investing thousands, thousands, thousands of dollars into influencer marketing. And I put a note here that I really want to share with you guys is, Influencer marketing, the market is valued at $13.8 billion in the year 2021. So in the year 2021, influencer marketing was valued at $13.8 billion. Studies show that it's supposed to not only maybe double or even triple in the year 2022. 
this means that a lot of brands a lot of these larger companies are investing a lot more money into influencer marketing than maybe those regular traditional marketing strategies that they implemented you know years and years ago so i think influencer marketing is a really really great way to get your feet wet within maybe the industry um of you know any type of service that you may want to go through and do as well and then last but not least, you guys, is to become a retail arbitrage seller. So retail arbitrage sellers, you guys, are ways that you can sell or purchase things at really low cost, upsell them on different platforms in order to make a profit. So I've seen this done thousands of times, especially on Facebook Marketplace, on platforms like eBay, maybe sometimes on Amazon as well, where you can visit different retail stores such as TJ Maxx, Marshalls, you're putting your products on different platforms such as Facebook Marketplace, eBay, Poshmark, different platforms like that and upselling it in order to make a profit. So that might be something that you might be a little bit interested in getting into. I actually think that it's quite fun because it's almost like you're treasure hunting in a sense. So that is it you guys. I hope that you guys enjoy these 10 plus strategies and ways of side hustles that you can implement in the year 2022. If this was helpful, please give this video a big, big, big thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.